Hi YouTube, welcome to Wespix. Uh, I thought it was about time I made a little video on how I polish my picks. There's so many different methods out there. Um, you know, people using the book method with wet and dry papers and uh, or just sanding or using all sorts of uh, super fine going up to seven, twelve thousand grit um, sanding pads and things like that. Well, I'm going to take you through mine. Uh, this is just a little profile I, I just knocked up. It's on Lorlox um, 301 stainless steel, as you can see. Not very polished at the moment. You know, it's not bad finish, but you know, it, what we're going to do. My my trick is. Well, get a pack out it's uh got thousands and 20 this is a 1200 grit wet and dry pad on a makita cordless let's get this out record uh makita cordless da sander or orbital sander and what i do i put it on top of a piece of well, granite that is i think which helps keep it cool and i do it wet so doesn't heat up at all, or very, very minimally. It's um, make sure we get plenty of water on it on both the uh, on, on the steel. There's plenty of water on here, and plenty of water on your DA. So excuse the noise. Dunk it in the water. The cooler you keep it, the stronger the steel will be. So with this method, there's no stabbing yourself. At the moment, it is kind of getting there. So what we're going to use next is a little felt polishing wheel on a Dremel. Get plenty of fine paste on there. Keep this wet still. Keep it pressed down onto the granite, which helps dissipate the heat, dunk it in the water, and again, you only need to go up to the, uh, where the handle starts, don't keep the polishing wheel in the same place, and I think We're pretty much done. So polish this off. There you go, you can see where I've stopped polishing. And that is how Wespix polishes his picks. Nice and clean, quick, keeps it very, very cool because you've got so much water and heat to dissipate. Uh, 
it, for me, it just works. You know, I've stabbed my fingers so many times trying to trying all sorts of other methods. Uh, this is what works for me. So I hope you enjoyed that. Thank you very much. <laughs>